Welcome to Moo Moo Math and Science. In this video, let's take a look at some igneous rocks. Igneous rocks are formed when magma or molten rock cools. This magma can either flow to the surface of the earth and cool quickly, and these rocks are called extrusive or volcanic igneous rocks, and they generally have very small crystals. Or they can cool inside the earth, and these are called intrusive or plutonic rocks, and they generally have larger crystals than the extrusive igneous rocks. So up first, let's take a look at obsidian. Obsidian is a igneous, extrusive, or volcanic rock. It's made up of quartz, alkali, and field spar. It looks a little bit like glass, and it has a hardness between six and seven. So there's obsidian. Next, we have granite. Granite is an igneous, intrusive, or plutonic rock. It's made up of field spar, quartz, and mica. It has medium to coarse grain crystals and a hardness between 5 and 5.5. Next is basalt. It's an igneous extrusive rock. It is made up of plagioclase, field spar, and pyroxene. It is dark and dense and is very fine grain and it has a hardness between 5 and 6. So there's basalt. Next we have scoria. It's an igneous volcanic rock. It's made from feldspar, augite, and also hornblende. It is basalt with cavities filled with other minerals. And finally, we have rhyolite. It's an igneous extrusive rock. It's made from field spar, quartz, and mica. It has a very fine texture, and often it has a porous texture, and uh, it can float in water. So there we go, five igneous rocks. If you need to know more about igneous rocks, this playlist should help. Thanks for watching, and Moo Moo Math uploads a new math and science video every day. Please subscribe and share.